Yo, what's up guys? It's your girl Dev, and we just got a new event in 1315. I'm sure 90% of the kingdoms across Rise of Kingdoms uh, definitely got this event, is the Soroli Assault. Uh, this is a 12-man event for Freyda. Um, only the Ice Queen, uh, that's kind of funny, also maybe, anyways, this event is really cool because it's a little bit different because you get to pick 12 people instead of the standard four. Uh, this will go a lot faster than it would normally go just based on the fact that there's 12 of you. I decided to go with my Alex and Sun Tzu because I remember Freda from before, before I started this, I was like, you know what? I'm gonna go with more of an AOE. I did. I'm like, oh, sweet. This is pretty cool. What I did notice is, if you remember in the update, they talked about a taunt button. So I was like, huh, well, I mean, there's nothing else new here. So they definitely said that they were gonna add a taunt. And if you look at the bottom right hand side of the screen, you'll actually see a taunt button that I just activated. It is a three second taunt that has a 10 second cooldown. Now, that's pretty dope. Um, so like, let's say you are a Richard and like a Charles or something, and you're a tank, right? You can taunt her or him, the new commander, um, and that way you're getting their focus on you. No one else but you. For three seconds, you get the focus of the boss. Now, the focus may or may not stay. I'm not really sure. It seemed to work. Um, we did cause her to ice cap, so we did have to move off to the side and complete this part. Um, just like before. My dog in here. Pause. Uh, the, uh, you can actually AOE these. This is why I figured, well, Sun Tzu would be really great because you know, she does you know, these little barbarians do spawn, so pushing on it would be great to have a good AoE. And, you know, there's a Charles there for a tank. I definitely tried to use the taunt button during this. I was like, well, maybe I can taunt the bad guys, you know, the little barbarians. It didn't work. Um, and uh, it didn't quite get their action on me, I think. I mean, I used it, but I really don't think it worked. So... I mean, it was a good try, I guess. I mean, it was it was still pretty cool. Uh, I'm still understanding how this event worked because, oh wait, here's your active skill. And then we gotta wait. And then there's two, and there should be one more, and three. So you definitely, she does have that skill still. Um, it's horrible AOE. So if you're in that circle when she procs that skill, it will hurt. Now, if I'm understanding correctly, hard mode, I don't think, I think has it. I'll have to do it on my, my mini and see, but for sure it's on nightmare and hell mode. And I'm sure hell mode that those barbarians are going to hurt a lot more. It took us uh, one full round. We got 20 tickets. I mean, I don't really, I didn't really know what they were used for at that point, but I mean, 20 tickets for what? Oh, a bejeweled chest. That's cool. And look, they have pre-assigned rewards. Now that's pretty cool. That means that no matter what you do, and how many times you do this, you're gonna get the same result. You're gonna get all the materials. The problem is you have to do the event till it's finished to get all the rewards. Well, it's obvious, right? You gotta do it. Any kind of these events, you gotta do that. So, and it looks like you can only do it one time every 12 hours so you it takes 50 challenge horns to do it mm. oh i'm on hell mode that's why it didn't work you have to be 50 million power to do that this one's at 30 i'm gonna go ahead and invite my lines and come right back all right guys so i went ahead and Asked my alliance to do it. I did get one member. I did get a notice from one of my T5 members is that they're going to wait to do it on hell mode. And they have a point. This mode should be done on hell mode if you're over 50 million power. If you're below 50, I would say it's safe to say it's okay to do it. 
uh, without being 50 mil or above. So Nightmare is the way to go. Um, did the same blowout as before. 20, 20 200,000 T4 infantry with an Alex and Sun Tzu. Sorry, I had to really think about that. I mean, this is kind of cool, right? I mean, it's the same as before. Um, I feel like this one's going a little bit better. I feel like we have more AoE, not enough Richards, not a whole lot of Richards, so a lot of damage output. And I really feel like heavy damage on her is really important because you don't really need AoE if you can take her out before, unless it she procs her skill sooner. I'm not sure, but we'll watch and kind of find that out. Um, a lot of us are using that taunt skill. Kind of cool, right? I really like that taunt skill, actually. It's quite impressive. Um, I mean, it lasts for three seconds and it has a 10 second cooldown. I mean, I guess if... I wonder what it would, the case would be if she was running. Oh man, we're gonna take her out before she actually beats her skill. Heck yeah! Whoop whoop! Nice! 20 more uh, tickets. Now, that was cool. Oh, we're gonna open up this chest here and see what we get. Um, so, I mean, you got these vouchers, right? So we got 40 of them, 20 per. Uh, it's only for her. And, I mean, I guess. We'll see what kind of rewards we're going to get because it's out of the 101 rewards. Um, I feel like it's delayed because I clicked it twice. And look, I got some pretty cool stuff. Material chests. I got some blueprints, but the class of Force Guardian isn't that gathering. Don't really get any gathering. I mean, maybe? Well, here, so you can see that I've claimed most of the rewards, not all of them. So, I mean, I really like that. All right, guys, um, this event was pretty simple. Uh, you definitely don't need a troop expansion. You don't need any type of attack buff or defensive buff. I guess if you had one, that's great. You don't really need it. Um, for those, players that are over 50 million power and are listening to this video only do hell mode uh, because those rewards are really good uh, I, I would assume the rewards are a little bit better actually not 100% sure I don't do it on hell mode so I can't really tell you I do recommend that you do this every 24 hours or every 12 hours it seems like it's a 24 hour cooldown on getting those bones this video is simple to the point I definitely think you should try it out and that's about it so for now guys keep it real